Green roofs are cool. They're beautiful, but they're cool too. Like they actually help cool the city by reducing the heat island effect. That's when all of the cement in the city absorbs heat from the sun and radiates it back. Plants help mitigate the heat island effect by holding and releasing moisture, cooling the air. Green roofs help insulate the inside of your building too, or your school, or your home. You stay cooler in the summer and warmer in the winter. And you save money because you don't have to spend as much on your energy bill. Green roofs take in carbon dioxide from the air and process it through photosynthesis, releasing fresh oxygen that we need to breathe. So green roofs help soften the impacts of climate change. Green roofs can even attract a greater biodiversity of insects, birds, and pollinating bees. One of the greatest benefits of green roofs is their ability to capture and hold stormwater on site. Less polluted water surging into our streams, less pressure on our wastewater treatment systems every time it rains. Here's how to build one. At the bottom is your roof deck. Add some waterproofing material. Then lay down a root barrier, followed by a sheet of moisture retention geotextile. Then a rigid drainage mat. Some filter fabric, and finally, just the right kind of specialized soil mix and the plants. Or you can bring in a pre-vegetated hybrid green roof system, a product created by the Live Roof Company with local plant mixes from the Green Feathers Company. Looking at the future, my future, what would be the collective impact if every roof in the city was a green roof? Seattle, 2050. Looking at the future, my future, when every building will be 100% sustainable, we're going to have some interesting choices. Thinking about the roof on my home, my school, the supermarket, the mall, office buildings. Should my roof be a green roof planted with vegetation that traps stormwater and sequesters CO2? Should my roof have solar panels to produce energy for all the internal systems? Should my roof be a place to walk, look at views, meet with people? Should my roof system have skylights so I can let in natural light and save on electricity? Should I grow food on my roof? Should I promote school pride with my green roof design? Should my roof be designed to harvest stormwater for flushing toilets, dishwashing, clothes washing, showers, landscape irrigation, cooking and drinking water? How small can my green roof be? How big? Can a roof be designed to do multiple functions? Can it be beautiful? The future. It's going to be tough.